Hi everyone, welcome to Tonic Live with me, Owen. And me, Karen. If you haven't joined us before, what is Tonic Live? It's live tutorials with Karen, and I answer your questions and suggestions in the comments section. If you haven't joined us for a live stream before, what is a live stream? Well, uh, it's a live video, so we're here live uh, in Tonic HQ uh, in Bridgend, South Wales. And any comments that you write, so in, um, in the bottom there, we can see and we'll reply to them. And, and as we go through the show, I say hi to a few people. So just let us know. Let us know where you are, what the weather's like, where you are, what you're crafting with at the moment. Any questions about what we're going to make today as well. Um, always love to hear them. If you haven't seen Karen before on a show, again, she keeps showing up. We, there's nothing we can do uh, uh, about that, I'm guessing. But um, we'll yeah, um, try. yeah, I wouldn't. I'd love this. I, I'm sure. I'm sure Alison's watching um, in Spain. Yeah, yeah, I would think so. Alison's here, say, um, like most weeks, but Karen's been standing in, doing an awesome job and showing off some makes. She makes some cards for the show for for Create and Craft for some of our cards on there. Awesome. So, um, yeah, Karen's with us to show today, and we've got uh, a competition every week. So, any comments that you put that, that you put in there, um, if you comment whatever you've commented with, we'll draw one out of the hat, and, and you get a bundle. So, so you know, a nice little mystery bundle of of some items we put together. So, this week's card is. This. So, you know, you're probably thinking, oh, I see a, it's a tenfold card, a beautiful tenfold card. But there's a little more to this. There is. As a transformer, it's more than meets the eye. <laughs> so if you look closer here, look at that. Wow. It's a twist and pop. So, so this was the template and uh, put together by uh, Nikki Gilbert, uh, a recent joiner yes. to our, one of our blog, uh, blog team. So we'll put the template. So after this, so you'll follow along with Karen, but we'll put a little template up there. Uh, as well and, and we'll we'll put on Nikki's blog as well so you can have a little look there as well but yeah really talented uh, crafter Nikki and uh, yeah she put this together so Karen's gonna take us away I guess yes yes take indeed. us away Karen right okay so what I'm going to show you is how to make the, what we want to show you today is how to use our jewel drops so we've done them on one of the downloads um, which are on the tonic Facebook page yeah so I've used the heart and uh, I thought rather than just doing us a nice plate card, we'll, we'll do something a bit more fancy with it. Definitely. I'll, I'll show them the, um, the template. So if you're wondering when Karen mentioned there about that, yeah. about that template, this one on social media is it's not so the easiest thing. <laughs> yeah. That's pretty obvious. Like, yeah, yeah. There we go. So you can see that the hard side is yeah, better, you can just better upside. If I, that's I, upside I move down the camera, upside completely down. now. Right. Yeah. right. There you go. Yeah, yeah. There we there go. There you go. Yeah, so so th there's the heart. So you can see that this gives you a bit of a guide when you're using your... Not jewel necessarily drops. jewel drops, you could use them for you know, use crystal, crystal drops, drops as well. Crystal drops, crystal drops, anything, but with the jewel drops, it's, it's really light. Yeah. So that, because these are a translucent finish, yeah. you don't really want to see the, the you know, any any marks underneath no, it. it. So, this this just printed really lightly, uh, but they're, they're free downloads, so. Free downloads. So, yeah, Dan will put those either in the description or the comments. So, yeah. um, if you have just got your jewel drops, I think a lot of you will be just having them. You can uh, you can get that and just have a bit of a play around. Yeah, get, get well, it's nice to make a little couple of toppers. There's a heart, a star. There's. I'm not sure what the other ones are. There's a, there's there's a, there's a few there's others. Four. So, yeah, plenty plenty there for you to, yeah. to get playing with. But I'll still show you how to do. I mean, with Nikki's instructions, I'll, I'll show you how to do the uh, twist and pop mechanism for the card. Um, just using our super trimmer, so it's um it's 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 a nice it's a nice yeah, easy yeah. one to do. So to start off, we're going to cut the card down. It's an A4 sheet of card. We're going to cut it down to twenty nine centimeters. So I'm lined the twenty nine up on my uh, super trimmer. Yeah. And I'm just gonna. Is, is there any sort of, the sort of GSM that we're working with here? Just we, we still because we buy so much of it, it's usually two forty. Two forty. Yeah. yeah. I think with most yeah. of the cards we've done on the show, yeah. regardless of whether it have been bags or anything. Exactly, you know. we try and stick to 240 because you know then you're not going to get, um, you know, you're not going to pick something up that's, that's not going to work for you. Yeah, yeah. Uh, right, you've got to take the corners off. The way Nikki's designed this, we actually take the corners off. Um, we take a, a, a big rectangle of the corner. So I'm going to line up to five and a half centimetres. So I'll line that up here. And because you've got the measurements here, you know how far you want to cut. And I yeah. want to cut. I want to cut a piece out five and a half by eleven centimeters. So I line it up to five and a half, and I go down to eleven. And the same again this side. If anybody uh, watching, you haven't got so a super trim or so you're looking you for something like this. You can do the measurements. You can do it with a, a knife and ruler, whatever you want to do. But I mean, this is just so much easier because you've got the arrows, so you know. You can just press down, that's at 11, because that's where I finished. I can press that in and come back, and I know it's cut at 11. 
Well, that's, you know, if you are coming using, you know, a knife and, and, and you're looking at something, you want something like this, then, so this is our super trimmer, that's 153E. Now, if you hear me say a code at any time, that code is, um, it's related to all our products. So all our tonic products, whether that be uh, Nuvo, um, or whether it be, so it just dyes and, you know, and, and bits yeah, and pieces and scissors products. and tools and things like that. It's all other codes, so we'll have numbers followed by a letter. So this is 153E. So if you put into Google tonic 153E, you go up with a super trimmer. So mm -hmm. you'll be there. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take these these little portions off off my card. Yeah. So because I cut them at 11, I need to line up at 11 and cut to five and a half. On the same outside, you can bring it in because you can see where you finished cutting. That's the benefit of the transparent. Oh, it's um, amazing. Ruler. So there's two pieces out. And these are the other two pieces. Do you out. need these? No. No, you can ha you can have them. Oh, you can have them. I'll make my own card. Karen. Go on then. <laughs> go on then. Off you go. <sighs> Take that to five and a half. So what you've got is this. I'm going to change my blade to my score, and you literally just separate the the plastic ruler and the, it just pops in the, the trimmer comes with both so the trimmer yes. comes with, you know if you are yes, it does. thinking oh you know it just trims now you've got your score in there for yeah. making you know, what do you use a scoring blade for as well you can uh, do all of your card blanks with it so whatever you want to do you can make frames if you use the the blade but with the scorer you can you can score any any of the sort of the kinetic parts of cards yeah, yeah. you know instead of a scoring board you can just use one of these so because we cut that to 29, we know that we need to score, we want to score this in half, so we're going to go to 14 and a half, which is here. I want to score that. So that gives me my awesome. half fold. All right. So now what we want to do is... I'll show them on the weekend, just, just so we, you get a clear point. We can take a look, break, I know it's a complicated... It is, here. it is. So There's a lot of steps, but I mean, if you've got the, the recording of this, you can you can refer back to it. But also, we've got, Nikki's done some step-by-step -step photographs. Um, they're just slightly different from the way I do it because I'm using the super trimmer. And this bit here, so you've reached the paper t-shirt set. The paper t-shirt. It's, it's what, what I like to call the paper t-shirt <laughs> part stage. of this. I call it as now. <laughs> <laughs> what I've done, the paper t-shirt <laughs> section portion of the tutorial. Right. So what we want to do is we need to mark, on, on, our, on our main piece, we need to mark one and a half centimetres in from these centre points here. Yeah. Right, so I'm going to do that here. I'm going to pop that there. So if I put that on my cutting line, do a pencil, and I can mark one and a half centimeters, which is there. I can do it the same here. Line it up with my cutting line. Mark at one and a half, which is there. Same this side. Just realise how helpful the instructions were that Nikki gave because you get like oh, these. Oh, indeed. I mean, you wouldn't be able to follow this without having something, would you? Well, I suppose people do. You know, they see cards, and you know, very clever people. You know, they. Well, yeah. If well, you spend Nikki enough did. time to, to work it out or see a yeah. card, think, oh, how has that been put together, and sort of backtrack or sort of reverse yeah. engineer well, your card. What you're going to do is you're going to need a big cross um, emboss on these. So you line up your first pencil mark. Yeah. With the opposite one and do a, a diagonal score line. Again, the other side. She says, not pushing it through enough. That's fine. And with the other. Just line them up. Diagonal score line. So then, that one's a mountain. We're going to do these as, as valley folds, which is the opposite way. Did you know that? No. no, just not really headline. Yeah, it's just, if, yes. if you see, smile and wave, boys. If you see this look, if you see this glazed look, which, which I, when I just like look as I'm staring past you, that means I, did, I didn't know. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll do some bites. I haven't said hi to anyone yet. I've got. Um, uh, I've got oh, it's uh, my sister's diary. So, yeah, so on, on, on YouTube, there, uh, this is what we're watching. We've got um, Starfish 3 Mama. Uh, hello from New Zealand. 4am uh, here. Oh, uh, can't sleep, Sharon. Oh, what better? Sharon, what you, better way? You won't be sleeping. What this is too exciting. This card. <laughs> I woke you up with this. As soon as you saw this, you were just drifting <laughs> off when you saw this. The twist and pop. 
Uh, we'll go. Yeah, oh. uh, I got, and uh, yeah, Rian Warren. Hi to my sister Karen. Hello, Owen. Uh, you're doing a, a great job, Car. Enjoying the show. Christmas is coming. Can't wait for my car. <laughs> every time. Every she wants time. One of these. Yeah, yeah. You probably gonna want one of these. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone wants a twist and pop now. That's Definitely. it. That's all. Kinetic cards. That's the way kinetic. forward. Is that what they call it? Don't it's people kinetic, call it a bomb movement? It? It's kinetic. Like a pop-up, yeah. Yeah. It's cool. Yeah, it kinetic is. card, I'll, I'll, I'll allow it. <laughs> yeah, I'll allow it. <laughs> kinetic. Yeah, it's cool. Right, so to fold, to fold your, this is like the mechanism piece. This is yeah. the kinetic piece, isn't it? So you've got your, your t-shirt. Okay, yeah. And then <laughs> tell me pop more. it in. <laughs> I'll tell I'm you the basic, now. basic yeah. terms. And then it'll all fold into itself because we've just done two folds opposite ways, haven't we? Yeah, yeah. So it all falls into itself, and you get this, which is a little house. Your ha it's the house, house portion. House the house, portion. yeah, we're, we're on the house. house, you know, beach hut portion. It's a house now. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. So I'll open it out a little bit, so you, you do see the the kinetic areas. There's the fold. Yeah. It's like using that too. I like <laughs> to kinetic areas. It's quite like a sciencey yeah. spin to it. This is it. We need more of that in craft. <laughs> I'm only going to use the one I've already prepared because I've got the tape on it. Okay. All right, so I've got exactly the same again, all folding, ready to go. I've just popped some tape on. So you're going to need the second piece of card you need. I'm going to go back to Nikki's instructions because she's got the measurements. Could, could you glue that if you wanted to? You could glue it. But time. But it's time, isn't yeah. it? It's so much easier just to use the red line tape. It grabs straight away and, um, and we're there. So what you're going to do is you need a piece of card which is 28 centimetres by 8.5 centimetres and you need to score that into four. So that's at 7, 14, 21. Yeah. And you fold it. Fold it along the score line. It's a centre line. If you fold the centre line back and forth, so you've got the score line both ways. There's no so risk of breaking do, the paper there. Is that we're doing it too much because now? Because we've scored it. Yeah. So what you're going to do, if I move this super to my way a second, so you can see directly in the centre, you're going to line this up, put my tape on, so you, all you're doing is putting a couple of little bits of tape, you don't want to glue too far over, yeah. because it's not going to move, this is the, the whole idea of it, you're just grabbing it at the ends so that you can move it. So you put tape, top right, bottom left, and then you've got your strip, which you've got your your um your fold lines done. So you need to stick this centrally. So I take the cover off our red line tape and you've got your centre point here, which is where you want to put this. But before you stick it down, I've got my finger there so it's not sticking to the paper. Yeah. You want to try and get it as level as you can. Yeah, if, if you do want to bring that in here. here. And go. angle it here because I can't turn the paper because I want to try and get this straight. I've Which got, angle would be best for me to show? I, I want to show these marks here. Ah, look at you like go. A no, we haven't got a miniature helicopter. It's, <laughs> it's a drone. Believe it it's or not. It's a drone. Dan, Dan's got a drone yeah, as well. This this. There we go. Oh, that's, right. that's a good shot. Yeah. Yeah. So <laughs> what I'm trying to do is I'm, I'm, I've got where I've made my diagonal folds. I'm yeah. trying to get it centrally in there. So I'm just going to hold that down and put it down there. Take these bits Goodbye, of drone. <laughs> Goodbye, drone. Goodbye, drone. <laughs> Is it out? It's out. So just <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just going to lay that flat. Yeah. On the centre line. The reason I folded it back and forth is because I want that one to pop up now. Because that's the middle of my card. Ooh. And there is your. <laughs> Kablamo. That is well, yeah. She shocked you, shocked me again every time. <gasps> every <Whoa>. time. <laughs> Warn me if you're gonna do so, that. Yeah. So and yeah, I, but that's the that's the kinetic moving piece. Now the ones I've seen prior to Nikki's are just a small panel here. Nikki's actually fits into the card, so you're using this as another layer on your card. I'll, I'll do so, some um, highs, Karen, while, while you're getting on. ready. Um, Carl Shrive, Craft uh, Owen and Karen. It's oh, in here in, in Scotland. Um, I can, uh, Carl, uh, Nikki Goddard, hello, I should be working, but not well, so I'm turning in to cheer myself up. Uh, I hope you're feeling better, uh, Nikki. Uh, Ellen Coates, seen so many of these last few days, thanks for sharing the method. I'm, I've noticed that. It's, it's really more. popular. It's crazy. It's like, really like we, popular. We saw the shakers so... a few weeks ago, yeah. where every, you see just shakers everywhere, and then you start seeing these, <laughs> yeah. and 
We start the craze. Well, we start what the it craze is, I wanted to show how we do it. <laughs> I wanted to show how we do it without super treatment because it's so much easier yeah. than than having to measure things. Definitely. Um, we got we got Bev Huntington. Hi all. This car looks fab but complicated. We're gonna make oh, it simple. Oh, it's simple. not that complicated. With my, with my description, <laughs> subtitle. You got you got t-shirt stage. You got house stage. <laughs> How difficult it does it get? You break it down. I don't know what I haven't got a stage for that. No. That's quite a tricky, that's a tricky. stage. <laughs> the pop out stage. Kablamo. That's the pop out stairs in different directions <laughs> stage. <laughs> right. Um yeah, there's gonna be two seconds more. Um Karen Karen Oldnum, Crafty Nuno and Karen and Dan. She knew Dan was here. Just by the camera work and his, yeah, his yeah, deep voice in the background. Yeah, uh, uh, Dan, yeah, Dan does the camera, so I didn't introduce him at the start. Uh, Dan Aww. works and, and gets all the uh, the camera so and switches between the shot and you can hear him uh, yeah. helping with stuff. Biffin. I don't know. I've something I think that's funny every now and then. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, she says, nearly forgot this was on. Looking forward to this demo. Liz Water says, good afternoon all. Uh, watching on your lunch break. Yeah, hope you're enjoying your, your lunch break. And yeah, you can always watch it back later. So all this, say you missed a bit of the start, just caught us, just tuned in, all uploaded later on Facebook and yeah. YouTube. Right. So we're going to pop this into an actual card blank. And I've cut that at... Oh, 10 <laughs> centimetres wide. There you go. 10 centimetres wide. Go. So it's the full length of the A4, but it's 10 centimetres wide, and I've folded it in half, scored and folded it. So what we're going to do is just take the tape off. They're just going to stick to you. I'd leave them if I was you. Clean up. <laughs> yeah. Dust buster. Just like, <laughs> I don't think. Are they still do them? Dust, I, I, know, know. I think you get a you get a little dice in there. I think they go out of they are fashion yeah. a little bit now. Yeah. Like, yeah, quite gonna, put, my gram still them. had like has when like charging oh, constantly you? on the wall. Like yeah. it's just <laughs> crumbs. <laughs> when I over, over the chest. Over. <laughs> <laughs> I could do with that definitely, <laughs> especially uh, after being crafting yeah. <laughs> die cutting, smack the dies. <laughs> It's everywhere, I'm in my it. hair, over my hair. Yeah, like it's probably like the ladies have got like a mini Henry in, in, in the office, but I don't yeah. think they use it as much as a little bit. As it should. Yeah. Well, <laughs> yeah, uh, have you seen the I haven't heard now? it from the other office. <laughs> right, so I've stuck the one side in and instead of just like putting that down and perhaps it wouldn't line up squarely, I'm just gonna try and line it up a little bit better, she says. Famous last words, though. There you go. Famous last yeah, words. Yeah, well, I'll current sort in that. I got, yeah, there I made, go. I made these in. inside a box. Good afternoon, everyone. Hi, Amanda. Um, Judith Clark says, hi, Owen and Karen. Love this card. Girlfriend ringing me. <laughs> <laughs> she should know. Does she not know <laughs> you're knows. busy? Does she I not know? She's busy, yeah. Oh. I think we, we change time. So we're, we're usually at... Um, we're usually on, say, on at this time of the week, you know, 3 p.m. So we changed, Karen's uh, here in the morning to be able to help us out in the morning, so we changed them to morning, midday time. But otherwise, you know, whatever time's best, so always put comments on what you'd like to see or improvements to the show and things like that. Because we can always try Bring and... Bring back out. <laughs> There's been a lot of that. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. We've had none of that. In that. But uh, I'm sure all, all of you miss Al. And Al's back from Spain. I think maybe, maybe next week. Next week. Next week. <laughs> we got, but uh, yeah, so, so we change around the time zones, but we, we're look, still going to find the best time for, for you guys. I know we catch when we're early in the morning, we tend to catch people from all around the world. Uh, like when, when we're in, in the afternoon, uh, UK audience, like you're just coming home from work and, and bits and pieces, so we catch you now. Right, I'm just going to decorate this up. I'm going to just pop some die cut panels in. I found that the ribbon and bow set fill, fits in really, really well. So, do you want to turn that one over uh, when I'll see? This one. What size I used. There we go. There we go. So it's that one that I used there. So if you've got the ribbon and bow, bow skill dies. Yeah, I uh, cut it with the, I, I just cut the outside edge in red and um, put the pattern in. Cut the next layer down again out of one of our papers. Yeah. From the paper pads. And I'm just going to put a little nicely, bit yeah. of, It really does fit so well in here. Uh, Sandra Whiteman says, Good afternoon, Owen and Karen. Uh, so glad to be tuned in for this, de this demo. Looks great. Thanks, Sandra. Uh, Victoria uh, DL. Oh, so, so I, I said it right. It. I, I've spoken to you before the show. Um, Victoria also makes some cards for, for our shows, creating craft shows. Lovely cards that you would have seen. Um, 
Yeah, I, I think never like, been able I, to I've, say I've known anything. him, but I don't speak to him on the phone that often. So it's like I've, I've never known to mispronounce. When you must be awful when you're mispronouncing something for so long, and then and then you find out like as um, yeah, DL as in as she told me it was like in a DL card. That's how to remember. So, uh, there you go. So nice way to uh, to remember it. Um, she says, "Lovely sunny day here in Cheshire today. Fabulous card, Karen. Uh, Decorated it. beautifully." Brilliant. And um, Amanda, have you got a photo, please? So I think, oh, so someone's asking, yeah, if you've got any questions for any of the other, so people who are commenting as well, comment um, and help each other out. There's actually a, a Facebook page which goes along with uh, these Tonic Live tutorials. So it's called Tonic Live Chat. So, and Dan will put it in, in the comments there. That's just a Facebook group where you can upload your cards, which, which you've made, and we show on another Tonic Live show on Friday called Tea Time with Tonic, where we go through your cards and just show off and have a bit of a chat, show your cards off. But yeah, Tonic Live Chat. So if you haven't joined that group already and you're watching, yeah, make sure to join it because there's uh, there's loads of cards there and you can ask each other questions. And crafters seem to be the most helpful like consumers are around. I think you know that everyone's helping oh, each other when they buy well, something. They've got a question. Something like this now. I said, Nikki, all right, if I use your uh, instructions tomorrow, and she's like, yeah, go on, That's it's it. fine. I think it's, you know, it's always flattering like if someone's using your your card or a design or something that you've yeah. done. You know, it's not yeah. like something all like, you know, smart. Well, and... I've just put some just some panels in just so we can see, and I've got some die cuts from our celebrations. Yeah, the celebrations. Set. So there's lots of like quite cute. Yeah, little... I use some of the little ones. I've used loads of different die cuts on this. You can see them down there. I'll, yeah. You'll see them closer up once we you know they get close to the end of the card, but you yeah. can see them all there. But I'll just I'll just glue them on. If you you need to glue them on flat, really, because it'll catch on the inside. It won't it won't close. So I'm just literally just gluing them on, just quickly. Because what I want to show you more than anything is the jewel drops. Yeah, yeah. The jaunty angle there. And the jaunty. That's what I mean. Jaunty Artistically angle. jaunty. <laughs> There, there, there must be purposely, a name. There must be a name for Purposely that. on the wonk. There must be a, like a name for for that. It's a jaunty angle. Like, it's a jaunty hey, angle. I'm, I'm having a bit of fun. It's a it's a fun card. <laughs> that, that's what it's, it's. I'm never gonna get those straight. So I'm gonna put them purposely <laughs> wonky. That's a better. That's a better way to. Yeah. That's a better way to do yeah. it. So I've done an 18 card because I'm using congrats on the outside. I'm using all the little presents and little cake there and things. Really, so. this for an 18th bit, this is a, a this is a wild card. It's yeah, a this whammy. Is. It's giving you a whammy. Yeah, Alright, so there's some I've just stuck those on on the inside just for you to see. Oh, I'm gonna make sure I don't knock any of them off while it's closed. I have got some jewel drops. I've got one I've already. Oh yeah, this tape is a nightmare. It just sticks to everything. I don't think a dustbuster would even do a job. I don't it's think it would. I don't think it's kind gonna. Of like it's not gonna. To you. It's, like static. it's not gonna do it. Yeah. I'm gonna do some of the jewel drops first of all, just to show you. I've got. I've got mine. Yeah. So, can we see that clearly? It's not very clear because it's. You can just about make it out actually. Look in there. All I've done. I'll show it. Yeah, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know what the noise that was. There we go. There All we go. I'm going to do, you can see roughly where the dots are, and I'm just going to cover some of them. So you've got tiny ones, you've got a little bit bigger. So basically, I go a little bit random. I shove some pink in first, or whatever cover first. It's nice to have a little bit of a guide. Because I think yeah. really, I just, like, yeah. if I was trying to create something like well, that, well, you'd I'd, lose you'd lose the definition when you is where do, yeah where do you start where do you finish? So I'll just do a couple just so you can see, but you can you can see that I've already done one there. But I'll just pop a couple of colours on. So I've literally just gone. We should do like put like numbers. You know, if you if, if you, like new <laughs> crafting from, by new numbers, from by numbers, we, we, we call it <laughs> copyright. Oh, I'm not <laughs> I didn't even prefer that. <laughs> but just, yeah, literally just touch the, you know, for the tiny ones, you, I'm barely squeezing it. So, yeah, I hope it is clear for you guys on, on that camera. I think it is, like, it, you're seeing that. But we'll do our best, you know, if anything isn't The problem clear. is, these are quite, they're like, they're, they're like milky when they're wet. Yeah. Before they, before they kind of set, they go much more clear. They, they've got a translucent finish, but when they're, I just went in and I did 
it you know it, it'll take a while to finish but i won't do a full one i'm just gonna show you would you leave them to dry in intervals just so don't I smudge did. you don't i did i left yesterday on my third attempt <laughs> <laughs> after I'd already done two and then realised that I couldn't die cut it because I did it like this yeah, on the yeah, A4 yeah. sheet remember to die cut it first so I word warning uh, yeah, die yeah. cut it first die you get something to come up across yeah. there because when you think of the height of those dots you, you're not going to be able to run that through your die cut it afterwards yeah. so I had yeah. done the two and they took me yes. and they were they were fab they were precise they were amazing and then I thought oh man <laughs> no, no, that, that's, yeah, make sure you so, die cut it first. Yeah, then, guys. I die cut another two. I did. The, I printed them out again. I die cut it. Yeah, you at the moment, but there's three others that you. Yeah, there are three others. There, I know there's a star. What else yeah, is there, Dan? Dragonfly. Dragonfly. That's it. <laughs> it's um, it's a a lady. It's a dress. I know it's a dress. Oh, right, okay. So you've got so like the, the top one. half is like a stamp. You know I've, I've stamped ladies. Yeah. And the bottom is all uh, little dots for you to fill in the rest of our dress. So. That's great. So we'd love to, you know, if you've got your your, your clear drops now, so yeah. your your dual drops. If, if they've arrived, you know, show us something on for tonic uh, tea time with tonic on yeah. Friday. So so Friday four p.m. tea time with tonic. Me and uh, me and uh, Karen will be able to go through your cards and. Uh, I can just have a little chat through them and show them all off. I'll go through a few I'm more. I'm not going to do many more of these, though. I'm just going to show so every like, colour. Um, yeah, Carl Shrove says, uh, hello, Dan. Sorry I missed saying hello. Uh, nice man, is that? Yeah, Carl. That's, yeah. that's the nice, yeah. classy. Uh, um, Tracy Chapman says, I missed the beginning, so we'll need to catch up a bit later. But wow, that card looks impressive. It does. Yeah, if, if you have missed anything, it's all uploaded later. So if it's your first Tonic Live, first time you've joined us, I'll try it over your shoulder. I'll show the... Go on, Dan. Because you... Yeah, go on. No, if if you go go to the big shot, Dan, and, and I'll I'll show it. There we go. So you can see this this is the card. So if you just join us and you think, oh, it does look a, you know, a complicated card. That's what we're working towards. Here it's we real, go. It's a real power, isn't it? It is a power. power. It is a power. Kablamo. Kablamo. <laughs> kablamo. That's what it, I, I think. It's kablamo. A kablamo. It is that. You could put some sort of kablamo thing in, in oh, inside. Well, it would be oh, really good oh, for a, a superhero one, yeah. wouldn't it? it would be superhero good for a superhero card. Got power and better. Yeah. You can have like, every one of. I don't know. Every one of Batman's comments Aven that, he, that a, he used to say. An Avenger <laughs> on each or something, like a different picture on each one. If they like, you know, they're into Power Rangers. I think there's a new Power Rangers film coming out. So that's that's good. Power be. Rangers, back again. I know. My God. I remember them the first time around. <laughs> they're always more than my They're always there. Yeah, they're, they're, yeah, they're, they're back. They're back. I'm just going to do a couple more with the, the grey mist, and which is the... The only one I haven't to use. So. Alan Squires says, uh, won't let me play. So if, oh. if, if you're struggling to watch the, the video, if it's not playing as it should, either go over to YouTube. So, you know, we're playing live on, on YouTube as well. Um, but on Facebook, if you try refreshing it, it always works best through the app. So if you've got, uh, if you, any of you are on tablets, which some of you are, so your, your iPad, if you go into the app or download the Facebook app, lives and things like this, they tend to work more smoothly on there. I think Facebook, are, they, they're getting behind that and making sure they all work, work smoothly. Nikki Goddard, it reminds me of a colour blindness test at school. Anyone remember doing this? <laughs> it is a bit, yeah. It is a bit, yeah. I don't yeah. remember that. We talked about something like that in the office before, like yeah. colour blind, like if you, you couldn't yeah. tell. It does. Right, I'm going to leave it at that. What well, yesterday, what I did when I was when I was preparing these, I um I did a lot of it, but when I started to get a bit closer and my colours started merging, yeah, I I decided I'd leave it dry. Leave it dry. That's yeah. it. So Scrape two, the ones off. Two warnings from me. Scrape like, the ones off. Leave them dry don't, don't in intervals. Di oh, yeah. definitely die cut first. Don't I cut wasted first. so much time. <laughs> yeah, leave them to dry. Go. Yeah, you could, yeah, but you it, could it, manually cut it, I guess, with the scissors. Oh yeah, but yeah. I wanted to use. You wanted to use. I the, wanted to use my shapes. Yeah, the shapes. Yeah. So that is partly done. I mean, you just need to go in. I'd leave it a little bit later on then, and go back through, do some more that are closer to the other colours. Yeah. And they they won't merge then. Well, see, there's quite an, uh, you know, there's a good point on a new crystal, whether it be a crystal drop oh, or dual drop. There's a they good really point, are. so you can, and a, yeah. you know, delicate you touch, can and you get, can get. Uh, you can get so precise with them, you can get them so small. So I'm going to pop that one other way. There's our card that's finished. I'll put that over there. Oh no, you, you can have that one actually. <laughs> Um Yes, yeah, Sandra Lopez says hello from a sunny strood. It's only it's 
I, we haven't given you the weather, weather update weather yet. Oh. Cold, quite cold. It's getting cold yeah. there. No flip flops. No flip flops. Cara doesn't want to flip. I never. Oh. I never wear flip flops. I'm summer, devastated. You know. But yeah, devastated. It's, it's cold. At least my jumper is more. Except you know, except some people were like, "How could you wear a jumper last week?" <laughs> but like, it, it, and it was a, maybe a little bit mild for it. But today, I'm hoping it's this cold. jumper, it, yeah, it's, it's it's nice enough for a it's, jumper. Yeah, found it. Yeah, you've definitely got jumper. Uh, there. Sandra Lopez says, "Love the twist of pop card. Definitely going to be, uh, to give this this one a go." But, oh, yeah, I hope so. We, we'd love to, I'd love yeah. to see some of these. Show I think it's us gonna on be, Friday. This is gonna be it's going to be a craze. I think it's yeah. going to be twisting just and a popping. So just call. Uh, just cut the um, cockle shell down. Yes. Did we, did we yes, say that? Cockle yeah, shell. It's a cockle shell. And obviously I cut the, the white one first because it had my my image on it. And then just cut a red. I think it's the largest two sizes. So I'm gonna just glue that onto my card front. We got Sue Webster. Hello, my drops have arrived. Can't wait to play. Oh, lovely. Yeah, show, enjoy yeah, this, that's on Sue. YouTube. Show us uh, on, yeah, upload something to, to Tea Town with Tonic. So upload it to the Tonic Live chat page. And all you and have to we'll do. We'll pick them up on Friday. Yeah, we'll go Make sure it. you hashtag so that we'll be able to yeah. see them. Put, put a hashtag. There's a hashtag after. So a hashtag is that sort of, you would have seen on an old school phone. So like hashtag. It's number in America. I was going to try and show, show them like hashtag <laughs> to across the <laughs> Right, so <laughs> yeah, that, that, that's a hashtag, and uh, you put tea time with tonic after. So all is, as one word. It just makes it easier for, to, to, for us to find it. But we can look for you know your cousin, and we'll do our best to, to get as many of them on the show as we can. But yeah, upload them to that page. You have to do just upload your card and just say this was a card for you know my friend's fiftieth or something like that, mm -hmm. and just give us a little bit of something behind it as well, because we're always interested. We'd love to know. And postcards. So postcards. We, we, there's a few postcards on there. <laughs> Dan's going like postcards. <laughs> uh, um, yeah, yeah. So postcards on the back. We we asked a little while ago, uh, me and Dan, who's going to be our big feature. Uh, <laughs> me and Dan from for postcards from dreams. From because you know we love hearing from where all you guys are from, and we wanted to you know, just see because I thought everybody's got a postcard. Whether your, your place is Bridgend, which yes, not in my view probably doesn't warrant a postcard. Or, but Albert hasn't got a postcard. <laughs> Let me tell. I would have sent you one. Yeah, I would have sent you one. But I think no, I think Bridgend does have one. We've got a nice stone bridge <laughs> at Bridgend. You know, so it's about, but there's some lovely ones we've had from, from you know around the world. We've had so Dunoon, uh, Saint Neots, Cornwall. Where was this one? Uh, Bournemouth. And what was <gasps> this one? Uh, yeah, Isle of Man. And the Isle of Man. Yeah. So we've had a few, just to, yeah, because we, we love to show them and have them on the back. It's a bit of a bore feature. Mm. And I'm done. Send them, please. I'm done. Please. <laughs> I'm please. Done. Don't make me beg. <laughs> 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 Go on. That's it. I'm done. Yeah, wow. Done. Awesome. Done. I know. You just, he's not, no, he doesn't even care. He doesn't awesome. care I'm that I'm done. I, this mo I love this card. <laughs> We'll, 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 we'll show them both from the. So I'll turn them on the Ready? new account. There we go. Go on. Oh, it's not high. So I said, so you know, people come to this, you think, oh, you're te it's a tenfold card. Yeah? Oh. It's not a tenfold card. It's a boom. It's a, it's a kablam. It's like a, this is a, you know, a celebratory card. This is a great one. So this is a stand on a mantelpiece. This is one you want to pick up and, and it's, you know, it is sturdy, like I say, it's 240. But yeah, it, it but feels sturdy. It feels sturdy because we've got that double layer there because we've we'll, we'll pop the whole thing into a card. Oh, um, yes. So we got yeah, awesome. Yeah, well done, and thanks for um, yeah, thanks for Nikki for for, for letting yes, us, us, us use it. Yeah. Awesome Excellent. though, yeah, Darren. Great cards, and the crystal drops look great. We'll show we'll show um, Nia. They, they're dual drops actually. So we got clear. You can see the rays, and it does give even more texture and you know a bit of definition to your cards. There. I but know it, it would have really spoiled that if and I the tried to die cut it. <laughs> die cut. She's done it again. <laughs> She's done it again. But uh, <laughs> I, I, we'll stand those up and. Uh, yeah, we got beautiful card. Uh, Nikki says, Cal Shriver says, your card is very beautiful, Karen. And Annette, Thanks, Cal. Annette uh, McMenon in uh, Bakley, it says, what address for the postcard? She's asking the important question. Oh, yes. What, yes. <laughs> it's, 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 it's in the description. In the description of the video. So in the description of the video, we'd love to, it doesn't have to be a postcard either. If you send a card that you've made, because we have them in the office, and I, I've had you know some before, and I was standing up on my desk, some really nice cards. But, oh uh, yeah, you appreciate it. But, some awesome comments as well, so thanks again, guys. Don't forget to join us 4 p.m. on Friday for Tea Time with Tonic, so we're back on. If it's your first live stream and you enjoyed this, 4 p.m., all these videos are uploaded later, so if you just caught us, sorry you know, sorry you missed us, but it's all uploaded later, so you can catch up. This is our Facebook page, if you're watching on here. Like, if you haven't come across our Facebook page before, but this updates with everything, creating craft times, everything you've seen. YouTube as well, all our videos, all these videos get uploaded to YouTube, along with tutorials, uh, stuff that's been done, bits and pieces, so subscribe there to keep up to date with everything. 
and we got Instagram. So we did a bit of behind the scenes stuff. So we did a few uh, Instagram, so so sneaky pictures behind uh, for, for, for Instagram. So if you go on it, eventually, you, <laughs> so spontaneous. After, yeah, trying to be spontaneous, but it took me about five goes. So all, spontane- <laughs> all spontaneity was lost. But if, yeah, just do um, yeah. So if you go on Instagram, it's just a bit of behind the scenes stuff and a little bit of extra extra stuff there on Instagram. Pinterest, all our inspiration is on Pinterest. So every range we have, so from jewel drops, so you got the, uh, you know, so you got the, the cockle shell, bits and pieces ribbon of the pop-up sentiment, sentiments, ribbon, ribbon and bow, they're all on there and they've got their own board. So if you haven't used Pinterest before, have a look because you've got so much inspiration. You can go click through. So if you're looking for, you know, you're not quite sure what you want to do with a die set, have a look on there because there's, there's loads to do there. And um, we got Twitter finding. So Twitter, just updates, you know, with show times, just a bit of everything on Twitter there for you. So, so, so lots on there. And that's it from, from me and Karen today. You know, thanks everyone for, for joining us again. Me and Karen will be back Friday. We'll be back. <laughs> but as you say, popular demand. Yeah. Could be. I don't know. There could, could be, be demand there. There may be some demand. <laughs> but um, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll see you Friday. Thanks for lovely comments again. Hope you enjoyed this card. We'd love to see all, all your makes and we'll see you Friday. All right. So have a good week, guys. See you Friday. Have a good week. See you Friday. Bye. Bye.